Hi, so what is cloud computing? Well, it sounds complex, but I submit to you that the concept is used in other situations as well. Say, for example, time sharing is the cloud computing of real estate. How so? Well, let's say you wanted to buy a house, a, a summer home. It would be very costly because you're not using it all the time. Cost triggers risk. And it would be very rigid. You would have to always be going there. So there would be no agility. If we compare to this time sharing, the cost is a lot lower. So there's a lot less risk. And you have a lot more flexibility. Because you have a choice to go to many different places whenever you want to go. And you just use it for whenever you need to use it. Often the companies that offer time sharing allow you to go to a website where you do self-provisioning. So I'll draw the timeshare as a cloud because we're really not concerned about the maintenance of the real, uh, real estate that is involved. We just go there and we select uh, from a catalog of uh, choices, maybe a one unit uh, apartment or a two, a uh, two-bedroom apartment or three-bedroom apartment. And these are standardized packages from which I can choose. All of this is um, managed by some centralized management. And it allows, this model allows for multi-tenancy because it has features such as uh, chargeback. And there are two, uh, it's a win-win. There's two types of use cases. As a consumer, I have a lot of freedom in what I can do, where I can go, when I can go, a lot of flexibility. As the provider, I have a much larger uh, consumer set, so I can make a lot of money uh, by reusing all of this real estate. So now let's reflect on what the metaphor implies for cloud computing. It really works a lot the same way. Instead of purchasing hardware and software for every specific need, which can be very costly and risky because you have to worry about installing and configuring it and testing it, you have a pool of resources that allow you as a consumer perhaps to order something. So you might, you might go to um, the Oracle Cloud and order perhaps a database uh, template or, or a middleware template or some application such as a CRM or a ERP and it's ready and available for you to use it whenever you want to use it and for as long as you want to use it and it has something called elasticity that means that you can scale that means that as your needs grow um, you can scale with it you can you have resources to accommodate that growth so again as a consumer you use these services. But if you are the provider side, if you want to set up cloud computing, then uh, you also benefit because you can leverage uh, all these resources that you have across many different LLBs. And they allow for aspects such as multi-tenancy and you have chargebacks so you can charge back um, different departments. So it's a win-win for, for both parties, the consumers and the providers. So what is a cloud made up of? A cloud is made up of hardware and software. Hardware such as engineer systems like Exadata and Exalogic working together with software such as the Enterprise Manager to manage this environment and Oracle virtualization technologies. <clears throat> with Oracle VM, you can have templates for database or middleware for applications from which users select what they need and when they need it. Oracle offers two types of cloud computing. There's public clouds, so you can go to the Oracle public cloud and do the self-registration, have a catalog of different types of templates available for you to uh, choose from. You have centralized management that manages all of this. It's multi-tenant and uh, allows for chargeback. So that's as a consumer, you can benefit from using a cloud computing environment. Now let's say the other one is private, uh, private cloud. So private cloud is a, is a company wants to offer this model for their own departments, for their own uses. 
so they can leverage all of this hardware and software for use by many different LOBs. And then there's another scenario where you may have a mix. So you, you may have a public cloud, and then you have a private cloud, and you need them to integrate. Oracle offers software that allow you to do this in very standard ways and in very secure ways. So if you want to hear more about this, please contact your Oracle representative. Thank you very much.